back to the series. I have to pause for real quick to do some stuff, but I am back. So basically what we're gonna do is feed the pink slime Largo. So what you need to do is get anything that, like fruits, chickens, any meat, any fruit, you can free the Largo and it can like pop and once it pop it like gives you a key to a, another area in the game so i'll show you real quick so for example you can feed it like carrots Oops. so you just want to keep doing that Until it gets full. So what I'm gonna do is, and by the way, like I said before, I'm doing the five day rush. So I'm gonna show you how to do all of that and how we're gonna make 50 bucks, 50,000 bucks. So I'm gonna pick up some more fruit. Some more chicken. I'm gonna hurry back over here. Oh, there we go. See, and that's how you do it. Oh, oh, they just ate all the food, so yeah. So basically, that's what you wanna do. So, after we got the key, what we want to do is, well first let me go back to the base. So yeah, basically this is what we're going to do. On a 5 day rush challenge, I'm trying to get all these ports from these slimes. Basically, I'm going to sell them on the port machine. And that's how I make my money and I'm supposed to make like 50,000 bucks in five days so we're gonna see how that goes so let's see so what we're gonna do is this So as you can see, all of these ports will show a certain number of them. So each port that you put in here will give you that certain amount. So each port, let's say for the pink slimes, the pink ports are 10 bucks for each slime, I mean each port that you put in. So, and it all adds up after you put in all the ports and stuff, so, which is cool. So at night time, which is now, you can see that there's more slime that comes out at night which is really cool so over here you will find the next area or the next gate to the next land and you need a key to unlock the door so I'm going to show you real quick so yep Boom. This is how we get to the next area, which is the Moss Blanket. This is a new area, and this is more slimes, new slimes. And we're gonna. Oh, there we go. Oh, I don't need that. Oh. Oh, I can't shoot the thing. I got the update. I mean, upgrade. Okay, so I'm gonna throw this part because I don't need it right now. But yeah, this is basically the new area, the moss blanket. It's kind of cool actually at night because it's so glowy and so foresty. I like that. 
Uh, let's see, let's see. I'm trying to find more of these bomb slimers and trying to hide, find honeycomb slimes. I think they're, yeah, they're over here. So I'm gonna get me some honeycomb slimes. There we go. There we go. There it is. Okay, what's going on? So I have three honey slimes and I have two bomb slimes. So I just want to get five, or I'm going to get like six each. So I can make it even. Uh, so six. Okay, so basically this is the um set I'm about to do. I'm gonna have all my storage stuff here, and I'm gonna put eventually put the pink slimes right here so they can be far away from everything else since they eat basically anything. And so I'm gonna put like all the farm and food and vegetables over here, and then over here I'm gonna put like um more slimes. And I can tell you on with the rest, and I'll show you guys. Like, it's, all gonna, it's all gonna come together soon, so I'm gonna show you guys. So basically, actually, let's go back over there. I'm gonna put. Put. Those slimes. And actually. Once I get these updates, it's gonna be so much easier um, getting the upgrades for the um upgrades for their um, cages. So I won't have to go back and like pick up all the ports, and it can just suck it in. So basically, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna feed them. So basically, bomb slimers eat meat, and honey slimes eat fruit. So let's go find some fruit real quick. Just realizing I don't have any money. True, 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 true. Twenty minutes later. And the other ones are still worth forty-five, so that's why I went with the bombers and the honey slime. And I might just go back to the moss blanket to get some more. Please, if you're watching this, ugly, um, horrible. <laughs> Gameplay of this, my fault. This is horrible, but you live, you learn. Hmm. While we're at it, I want to pick up these. Would it be, yeah, it would be smart just to pick up the ports that I saw before at the moment, too. The ports are just worth it. It's better than nothing, basically. So. And oh my gosh, we're almost to 20,000. Even though we need 50,000, but this. Whoa, where did this go? How did I get out? My go port. Port. That's, oh, that was dangerous. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh 
my goodness, there's so many. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we didn't make it today, so <laughs> the five day rush, but we got to 20,000, which is still good in my book, so. If I would have done this strategy like early, early in the game, I probably would have made it to 50 or even more. But that's cool. Well, for you guys that are playing Slide Wrenches 2 and probably want to play the 5 day rush mode, you can just take my strategy because, I mean, it works. It just. It's a boring process. Three day six real soon. Like in one more minute. Oh, that scared me. <laughs> oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Day six, guys, guys. So we didn't make it, but we did okay. Well, I did okay, but like you guys was my witnesses, so we did okay. So yeah, that was fun though. I might want to just start over and do this again. Let's see. If not, I might just continue this let's play and just do adventure mode. Let's leave it like that. So yeah, I'ma end the episode right here and I'll see you guys next time on episode three. Bye. Thank you.